Well, listen to this. Three News Investigates is uncoupling new details about a mass overdose at a Baldwin Wallace off-campus home. This happened over the weekend. Five current and former students are recovering tonight. Three News investigator Lena Lai is with us now in the newsroom with more. What are you learning about this, Lena? Hi, Chrissy. Yes, the five current and former students are all linked to the BW men's lacrosse team. Three News Investigates has obtained the 911 calls from Saturday night that really describe just how serious the situation was. We think our friends are overdosing right now. Three of them just passed out in their purple. The overdoses at the home called for a mass response from several area departments Saturday night. Paramedics from Berea, Brook Park, Middleburg Heights, Parma Heights, the airport and Olmstead Falls all rushed to the house on University Avenue. They treated five young men. Sources tell me it was for opiate exposure. Two students are BW lacrosse players, two students are former players, and one is a graduate and former player. The 911 dispatcher is desperately trying to get any sober people there to perform CPR, but there is chaos. Ready? Listen, you guys are my heart right now. I want to hear two inches deep. You're going to pump. Are you ready? Go with me. Go with me. One, two, three, four, five. As a parent, to let your kid know that everything is dangerous right now. You know, there's no safe drugs. Yeah, the fire chief wanting this to be a teachable moment. In a statement, BW said student safety is their top priority and that the university counseling services will be meeting with all students involved. The students also face potential disciplinary action. Now, we are told that two of the victims are still in the hospital, but all are expected to be okay. Berea police are investigating, and within the last hour, I spoke to a lieutenant who tells me that officers confiscated cocaine and also marijuana and tests are underway right now, Christy, to see if those drugs were laced with anything like fentanyl. Mm -hmm. Yeah, because we know that it's been happening so much lately. Yes. Lena Lai reporting from the newsroom. Lena, thank you so much.